Hi guys and welcome back to another video. So as you can tell by the title, this video is going to be a vintage haul. So obviously as we can't get out to the shops um, due to lockdown, I decided that I would do a lot of thrifting from vintage. Now I've seen a lot of people rate vintage and say how good vintage is so i thought you know what i want to just try it myself like i've tried spark i've tried all the different ones so i just wanted to give vintage a go and what i can say from my experience is i am loving it so the prices are good um you you pay so you pay for your item then you pay obviously postage and then you pay like a little tiny like tax or protection kind of fee and um, which isn't a lot at all um so what i will do is i'll put the prices of each item that i have on screen so that you can see um everything i have got i have washed um there's some things that are have got tags on that I haven't washed for the simple reason they're brand new, they didn't smell, and if they did smell, they just smell of washing detergent. So I didn't feel like I needed to wash those, but normally I would wash them if they don't have tags on. Um, so yeah, I just thought I'd show you what I picked up. So the first thing I picked up is what I'm wearing. So let's talk about my shirt. So this shirt has just, if come closer, has got stars and moons all over. I absolutely love this little collar detail in here so you can do it up a bit, a bit more if you want to. Um, and I have just tucked it in, but it does, it is longer. So it does come back long like that. It is a bit sh long for me in the arms because I am short. So I do have short um, so most things are too big, but that's fine. I can just tuck it up if I really want to. It doesn't really bother me. Um, this is brand new. It's still got the tag tag on, as you can see here. So I have not washed it. This is originally from Boohoo. If you can see that. Um, and this is just in a size 12. And I just love it. So I wouldn't have it long like this because I don't think it looks cool like this or nice like this so I just literally tuck it in like that and then I'll have the back hanging out like that and yeah I just love it it's super comfortable it I didn't wash this one because it literally just smells of like washing detergent so it's lovely um so I picked this one up don't know how much this was on the top of my head but I will put it on screen now for you Next thing that I've paired it with are these jeans. Now these are Topshop jeans. Now these originally, um, without like the tax and the shipping, was £10. £10 for a pair of Topshop jeans. Now, that's just crazy. Um, brand new, with the tag still on. Like, you can see this. They were originally £42. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that because I'm a bit short for the camera. Um, but they were originally £42 and I got them for £10 plus postage and the shipping charge. Um, so I'll put the price on here. But these are straight leg jeans. Now I have a love-hate relationship with straight leg jeans for the simple reason I'm short. And because I'm short, they're normally too long in the leg or they don't come up high enough in the waist to make me look taller. They make me look a little bit like plumpy or dumpy however you say it um so i don't really get on with them but i see these and i thought you know what they're 10 pound i'm just gonna try it and i don't know if you can tell we've got like a frayed edge here at the top like all the way around the waistband here and what i like about these is they're the like you've got like a little clasp to do them up instead of just the button um, which I really like and then that's just the back the back has the um, little frayed edge as well little pockets and then they just go down straight leg obviously and you've got the little frays at the bottom as well and um, these are in like a washed grey um, and I absolutely love these these chains I cannot wait to style these and start wearing these um, just love these all together the next piece I'm going to show you 
get rid of that hanger is this piece now this piece here is originally from marks and spencers so it's just this beautiful um lace detail here with rose print and then it just goes down into this tie up detailing here on the wrist um and it's just beautiful and then the back is like a little cut out bit here with your with a little um button here and it just it literally is one of these that will just go on and float down now i am going to try it on with these jeans just because why not and they probably won't go with these jeans but we will try it and see so here is the beautiful marks and spencers blouse on now i'm not too sure i'd wear it with these jeans i'll probably wear it with like black trousers or black jeans um and or even a skirt i don't know you can tuck it in as well so it would be a bit like that um but this is just amazing like it feels so comfortable on and i would probably wear a better bra i'm not gonna lie but i just love this detail in here like it just it's just so beautiful and so pretty um I've got nothing bad to say about it. I absolutely loved it. I did wash this um, because it didn't have a tag on um, and I feel like it did need washing, so I washed it. But for the price, it's absolutely amazing. Like the quality is just amazing. And this will be really nice for when we're finally allowed out and I'm going out for a nice meal or drinks or whatever, just this with some black jeans or trousers or skirt or whatever and just be really nice um, it's nice and flowy which I like and yeah I'm loving this this is just beautiful like I can't get over how beautiful this design here is I mean my bra is really not doing it much justice but I just can't get over how beautiful this bit here is like it's amazing so I'm really happy with that next thing I got you know me you know I love Disney so when I see this I was kind of like oh it's kind of grown up Disney so I got it it's just this Disney shirt long sleeve shirt I have undone it here because I have washed it excuse me I have washed it um, and it's just stripy and it's got Mickey Mouse all over and then the back's just like this now this I would probably wear with either mum jeans or black jeans or maybe even these jeans I don't know I'm going to try it on with these jeans just to see what it looks like and then we will go from there this is originally from H&M it's originally from H&M if you can see that there the divided la label um, and then I have washed it it is in the size 12 everything I've got is in the size 12 um, and I have washed this one as well so I am going to try this on now so this is the Mickey Mouse shirt on so it is quite cropped so I have just tucked the little bits in at the bottom so if I pull it out it's quite boxy and it's quite cropped and boxy so that for my figure it does nothing so what I'll do is I'll just tuck it in if I can I undone my jeans that's great isn't it so just tuck it in like that and then there you have it all tucked in and it just it just gives it that much of a better look so it just looks a bit more a bit more flattering I absolutely love this again problem with the sleeves because it's too long but that's fine um what I will do is I will well, I can leave them like that. Or you could actually have them where you roll them up. Um, I'll leave them though. It's fine. Um, yeah, I absolutely love this one. Again, not much to say about it. It's just a Mickey shirt that, you know, it had to be bought. So I bought it. So the next piece that I do have... Oh, I've got two here. Next piece that I have is this silky shirt now i got this because it reminded me of dalmatians <laughs> dog lover alert um so i got this and it's just this beautiful blouse here with this 
like Dalmatian print so it's quite a long line and it's just got long sleeves it's probably going to be too long for me and doesn't have a name of the brand on it so don't know where this is originally from but I just see it and absolutely loved it so I can't wait to try this on let me try this on and I'll tell you my thoughts okay so this shirt is in a 12 so it's quite oversized my sleeve issue is a massive issue on this one but what I'm thinking is I'll just do something like that so it just like rolls the sleeves up underneath on itself so it's it's all right but I absolutely love this shirt like it is really nice material it's so comfy and where it is oversized it is really baggy here so I could tuck it into jeans like this or what I'm thinking is where it's so long like it's literally like a dress on me because I'm so short is what I could do is I could wear it as a dress now when I say as a dress I could either wear it with just tights and boots because it is this long and I could get away with that or if I'm if it's a little bit too hot and I'm not mm, I don't really want to wear boots and tights I could just literally wear this and a pair of trainers you know make it more cash um, but I absolutely do love this shirt um, I have washed this one as well and it has washed up really nicely um, it's a shame I don't know the brand, otherwise I could like let you know what the brand is. But I, honestly, there's no labels in it to tell me what the brand is, nothing. Um, but I literally love this shirt and I can't wait to style it. So all of these items I will style on my Instagram. My Instagram will be listed down below. Um, so yeah, I just can't wait to style this one up. Um, while I'm on to these I'm gonna just show you these bits and then I'll show you the last item um but yeah I absolutely love this it does give me like Dalmatian vibes not gonna lie but hey oh actually let me show you let me show you my boots because this is Dalmatian vibes let me show you my boots I picked these boots up off there as well now I'm just doing them up these oh my god these give me Corella Deville vibes, right? So, I picked these boots up and I was like, oh my god, love these. Like, just, I've never, I never had any kind of boots like this before. Um, and I thought, you know what, so I'm just gonna try it. These are brand new, not been worn. Look at them. So, so Corella Deville vibes not even going to lie these just give me Corella feel vibes immediately so then with this red lip Corella just give me a damnation just oh my god I just love these and I can't wait to wear these because obviously I can't wear them at the moment because I've got nowhere to go to wear them I'm not allowed out so bring on June 21st but I can wear these boots I just want to wear these boots and I couldn't believe the price these are um, what brand are you these are public desire boots they're from public desire and just amazing like I literally cannot wait to wear them so I can just imagine this as a dress with some tights and this I mean June I'm probably not going to want to wear tights tonight because it's going to be quite hot but Skin colour types. Bam. Just go out as Corella. Just love these. Like, oh my god, they're just like amazing. So the next thing that I picked up, now these are from Primark and these are well they're originally from Primark. These were a pound, but then obviously you've got the other fees on top, so they're a bit more than a pound. But I got these not to wear not to wear I have recently started a fabric business and I've started making like face masks dog collars handbags well not handbags but like little drawstring bags um, I've not got one to hand to show you which is really annoying 
Um, but I've got a face mask here that I can just, it's not finished, but this is like a face mask that I've made. So I just need to finish making it, basically. Um, but I got these, because I thought, oh my God, I love the print, and I could make something out of these. And for a pound, you know, can't go wrong, because these are in a size, these, these are in a size 10, um, and I'm not 10, I'm a 12. So these would not fit me, they'd be too small. So I thought, I'll just recycle them. So I've got this print, and, so I've got that one with just Mickey on, and then I've got this one with Mickey and friends. In this more colourful, vibrant print. I mean, they probably do look really good on, but I don't think they'd fit me. So, yeah, because they're a 10 and I'm a 12. So I'm gonna stick with my idea of making these into something else, which I think will be absolutely amazing to do that. So I'm gonna do that. I'm thinking maybe I can make a drawstring bag and then use the rest of the fabric for face masks. Who knows? But I just love them and I thought, like, them together is just an amazing print to use. So that's what I got those for. And then the last thing I got is again for summer and this is originally from nasty girl and it's in a size 12 it's just this beautiful rose pink and purple rose print dress now i don't know how i'm going to feel about these because they are elasticated and normally when i have elasticated here i'm like oh my god get it off me it's annoying but i just couldn't help myself to see how pretty this dress was and i was like oh i need it um so I got it. Um, it's got this lovely little detailing here. So yeah, I'm gonna try it on and let you know what I think. Okay guys, bad news. This dress is flipping amazing. I love it, right? Just love this. But it doesn't fit. I can't do this bit up. Literally. Does not go. Doesn't matter how much, it will not go. So, that's a shame, but if it fitted, it would be amazing. Um, the way it just sort of hugs is, it hugs all the right places basically, and it is lovely, just it's too small, so I would need it in a bigger size, which is absolutely fine because I've never shopped on Nasty Girl before, so I don't know what their sizing's like, and it was only cheap, so it doesn't matter. So what I can do is I'm just going to relist this on Vinted and sell it on myself. Um, these, which I was worried about being too, what do you call it, too tight, it's absolutely fine. Like it doesn't bother me at all. This bit here doesn't bother me either. I would probably wear a better bra because I have just got my nude one on um, with the straps. That pulls the strap down. So I would need a better bra. And I would need the dress to fit. But besides that, it's actually a really nice material um, and it is a really nice dress so I'm just going to relist it and hopefully look and see whether I can get another one maybe similar and just see um, but we will, we'll, we'll find something but other than that every other piece that I have got has actually fitted and been really really nice and everything I've absolutely I do love this dress so I'm a bit annoyed it doesn't fit but it's cool these things happen so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the vlog here vlog video it's not a vlog I'm going to end the video here and I will see you guys in my next video hope you have a fantastic weekend and week ahead and I'll see you later bye guys